Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. It's Wit here again with another video. I'm gonna be doing a what I eat in a day um, today for you guys. I wanted to update you guys real quick. So I'm stuck at home. Like, I don't know if you if you guys haven't heard, some people actually don't know what's going on, but you know, we got this person named Rona who's going around and taking people out. I work at Sephora, Sephora's closed. I gym at Lifetime, Lifetime said you guys can't come either. I literally have nowhere to go. I only go to work in the gym and church. Oh yeah, and church is canceled too. So all I can do is live stream it on Sunday. So I'm stuck in the house for the next couple of days, weeks. I don't know how long I'm stuck here, um, which is fine because I really don't want to be out and about touching people and whatnot or whatever. But I am going to go somewhere actually real quick right now due to all that's going on. Gas is really, really low and I mean, it's cheap. And my gas tank is about to be on E. So right now I saw gas for $1.60 something. So I'm just going to go over there, fill up my tank and park my car. So whenever we are able to, you know, go back places when things open up, I got a nice full tank <laughs> on the low, low. But anyways, you guys, so I wanted to update you on what is going on with my weight loss. So I'm just giving you guys numbers and stuff because people ask me like how much I weigh and whatnot. And I mean, I really don't care. Like at the end of the day, it's just weight. I don't physically look my weight and I plan on losing more anyways. So um, if you guys watched my previous vlog, I went to Miami. So before I went to Miami, I was 211. When I came back, I was 214. Now, 190, 190 pounds is my comfortable weight. I want to essentially be like 177. The lowest I've ever gone to was like 183 pounds. And when I was there, I felt like I kind of looked a little weird. So I have to kind of see how I look and see if I like it, see if I want to keep going. But when I came back from Miami, I was sitting at 214 pounds. Like when I say I could have cried seeing that number on the scale. So last week I was eating super clean. I would only eat two meals a day. I was fasting. I was doing like... 18 hours of fasting i mean usually it's 16 but by the time i'm able to break my fast i would have to go to work so i would have to wait till my lunch break so it'll go into like 18 19 hours of me fasting so i was doing that fasted every single day only ate two meals i was eating super clean watching what i was eating and i was able to lose seven pounds so now i'm sitting at 207 pounds the goal before the end of the month is to reach 200 i would like to lose seven more pounds so i know that last week obviously probably some of it was water weight so this week i'm trying to see if i can shave off four pounds three to four pounds and then the last week of march another three to four pounds depending on what it is and that'll get me back to 200 and then i would have to worry about losing an additional 10 pounds to get back to my nice comfortable weight of 190 and from there kind of gauge to see how I like how I'm looking because I don't want to look sick you know so yeah that's where I'm at right now it's 1041 and I use the app called zero I showed it in my last video so right now I am 16 hours and some change into my fast probably eat when I get back from the gas station I want to stop at Walmart and see if they have any more garlic aioli sauce because there's like this type of like sandwich I like to make. I buy like the rotisserie chicken and like some bread to make sandwich. But um, I don't know. I might stop by there. But <laughs> your girl got disposable gloves. Listen, Rona not finna take me out. Let me just say that right now, okay? I didn't pray to God. My God is powerful. More powerful than coronavirus. And y'all need to believe that. I real life don't know how I'm going to manage being at home for this long of a time. Like this is long as hell oh i need to go to the front office and see if they have like a package that a friend of mine sent to me and my mom oh thank you so much kayla so she sent me and my mom all these masks she sent us two boxes and then it's another one in there but she sent us some like little um hand sanitizer thank you so much i mean I plan on staying at home if possible but whenever i do go out i will put these on so thank you so so very much for all of this so i just got to walmart um they look pretty pretty soft well, all the, the vegetables but nobody wanted that but i'm pretty sure all the hot pockets and chips and mess and junk is all gone yep everything's out hopefully they have what i want Cleaners. It's usually kept over here. I just need my garlic aioli. I think they're out of it. All right, so I went to the grocery store for one thing. Came back with all of this. So I stopped at H-E-B and Walmart. So I'm just going to do a little mini grocery haul. So 
starting off with these i don't really snack much now because i'm trying to really cut back on that so even though these are healthier um alternatives to like you know your doritos and whatnot um got this so this is i got this from h-e-b this is the cauliflower pretzels and i like this because um the serving size so you can get you can have 40 sticks and it's 110 calories i've never tried this before so hopefully they taste good i have tried this i love siete like oh my gosh like i love their hot sauce and i really do like their chips um so these are dairy-free paleo and vegan and so are the cauliflower i believe for one ounce so like about 15 chips is 150 calories then I got me a Quest Pizza. So like I said, I'm not keto, but if I can do low carb, I would. So got me this because the entire pizza is 12 grams of carbs. Usually if I eat half, I'm pretty content. Um, content. Then I got me some pepperoni because I like to add on top of that. So I like to put my own type of um, stuff on there. So I like to put pepperonis. I got me some chicken breast for this. And I already had like some breakfast um, sausage that you would put on pizza as well. So I got those. Got me some spicy patties that I love to eat. Got these from Walmart. By the way, I got this from H-E-B, Walmart, Walmart, Walmart. I got some more bang. I love, right now my current faves are this and the Miami Cola. This is like one of their most recent flavors. So I got me two of those. Needed some more foil. Got me some Himalayan pink sea salt. Sorry, no, some Himalayan pink salt. Got me some red chili flakes. I want a piece of seasoning, but couldn't find any, so I'm gonna just put this on top of that pizza plus season with other stuff. Got me some Slappy Mama. I usually like the spicy one, the one that's all red, but that sold out, so I had to settle for the yellow one. Got me some Power Waffles. I've never tried this, but it's Shay Curry here on YouTube. Talks about this all the time, and she loves it. I like watching her video, so um, got this from Walmart, so I'm gonna try it out. Had to give me some more paper plates. Had to give me the bougie ones because the little cheap ones are all gone. So got me that. Got me some buffalo sauce because I might want to make some wings and just drizzle this on there a little bit. Couldn't find garlic aioli, but I do like Whataburger's creamy pepper. So um, I'll probably just put this on like a little sandwich that I would want to make. I'm running out. Like I'm not completely out, but I do need more dishwashing soap, and I really don't want to like go to the grocery store if I don't have to. So I just got me another one, but I got me like a little mini and some air freshener. You know, you got to keep the restroom area smelling good, okay? Because I don't want to be smelling nothing. So that is it for my grocery haul. Now I'm actually gonna have my first meal. So I meal prep. I got me some wings in here, some French green beans, and some white rice. I'm actually hungry. I'm going to have my first meal and then I'm going to go ahead and start filming a makeup video. That video might go up before this one. So I'm going to do that and then I'm going to just start editing. I'm going to be editing these next two days and then I'm going to film another video on Thursday. It's going to be a Shein haul. I got like $300 worth of items. All right, so this is my lunch. Honestly, it looks pitiful. I have a little bit of rice some green french green beans underneath here and some lemon pepper wings that i made honestly it looks really pitiful but it is what it is um one more thing before i even start eating i forgot to say guys green tea listen if you don't got green tea get green tea okay this is one of the things that i also did i drink this day and night okay green tea and i get this one the one with ginger and probiotics honestly i don't really care too much about the ginger i don't really taste it but I have to get the one that says probiotics. It's hard to find this for some reason. I can only find this at HEB. Like Walmart does not have this one for some reason. I like that it has that because it obviously helps with like digestion, like your guts and all that stuff. But green tea will literally get your stomach feeling really flat. Like I kid you not, I love this stuff. I drink it plain. I don't put any like um, anything in there. I just literally boil the water. I always use two tea bags so I can go through a box in like a week. Like. If I drink this every single day, twice a day, and I'm using two tea bags, that's four bags. Yeah. All right, I'm about to break my fast. I've done 18 hours of fasting. All right, so I just got done filming this look right here. I want to come on here and ask you guys, for anyone who has been like, you know, on a weight loss journey, 
let me know down below in the comments like how your um weight loss is going how much weight you've lost or how much you would like to lose just you know let me know like update me i like to know these things it definitely helps motivate me and anybody else who could be reading the comments so let me know down below how it's going for you guys if any of you guys are doing it or if you're not on a weight loss journey if you're on a weight gain journey or if you're just maintaining just let me know what you're doing to physically and mentally be healthy and be the best version of yourself okay i hope you guys can see but we finna make us some burgers but they're gonna be bunless so I'm gonna take my olive oil spray the pan down honestly you could throw this in a george foreman i have one i just don't know why i'm not using it take the spray again spray them and then i'm just gonna season it with some slap your mama slap your mama i'm gonna be using this this cheese right here this was back from my you know my vegan days when i was like a vegan for like two weeks one slice of the cheese is 60 calories. And then I have me some lettuce right here, which I'm gonna use to like eat my burger. Then I got me some sugar-free ketchup. Any way you can cut down your calories, do just that, essentially. So this is gonna be my last meal of the day. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this cheese on here. The only thing I do not like about this vegan cheese is that it doesn't like, it don't be more into melt, so. I usually end up having to throw this in a microwave just to like melt the cheese down. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and plate this. I'm just using my hand. And I'm gonna just go ahead and put that on right there. Like this. Oof, oof. Okay. And then I'm gonna take my ketchup. My, my dumb behind did not open it. I'm gonna go ahead and just, oh! No, just whatever. Put the ketchup and this is dinner. All right, so let's go ahead and eat our supper. Yum. So I'm gonna go ahead and eat this. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you're not yet subscribed, make sure you go ahead and subscribe. Also follow me on Instagram if you're not yet following me. And until next time, I'll talk to you beauties later. Bye.